I'm Dr. Amy Anderson, Director of Curriculum and Instruction for iTeach. It's my pleasure to give you an overview of what courses look like in Canvas today. When you log into your Canvas platform, the first thing you'll see is the syllabus. This is your splash page that gives you information about your course instructor, the format of the courses, um, the sequence of instruction, the objectives covered. Um, all of our coursework is organized into modules and on the syllabi page, it breaks down for you the summary of each module, what you shall watch, read, and what's expected for you to accomplish at the end of each module. All of your course information and things that you need to read and do are located in modules. Notice I clicked on the left where it says modules. This is a really great place to get started. This is the very beginning. You would click on first page, you would read it, watch the instructional video, and notice on the bottom right where it says next, you just click next, and it progresses to the next page in that module course. You can continue along this way using this navigation, or you can go back over to modules, and you can click to any particular page that you wanna see. So there's a couple of different ways of getting around the module. At the end of the course module is where you'll find the assignments that you might need to do. It might be a quiz, um, it might be an assignment that you need to turn in. For example, module one in course 5100 has a quiz and I have a sample student in here that I, I, I gave him a bad score on purpose. So you could see that you have three chances to take your quizzes and when you're unsuccessful on the first one, it will reset at midnight that night, and then the next day you will be able to take the quiz again. Some of our assignments are not automatic quizzes. Some of them are assignments that you're gonna turn in and you're gonna be supported by a live instructor. Most of our instructors are still teachers in the classroom, so they understand what it is you're, that teachers are going through. This is an example of the first assignment, the Teacher Why and Visionary Mission Statement. The assignments are tailored for you to get yourself ready for the classroom, and also this one helps you think about why it is you want to become a teacher. All the assignments have rubrics attached, and this is what our instructors use to grade your assignment, so you know exactly what the expectations are. If for some reason there is something missing, your instructor will give you fantastic constructive feedback and allow you two more chances automatically um, available to you the next day. And you're able to see your grades by clicking the grades tab at any time, which is really great. And then periodically your instructor will provide for you announcements. This one is just welcoming you to the course. The home and the syllabus link takes you to the same home page. And that's pretty much it. It's super easy to navigate, very user friendly. But thanks again for watching the video. And if you have any wonderings or any concerns about what's it gonna be like learning online, don't worry about it all. Our instructors take great care of you and it's super easy to navigate. Welcome to iTeach.